In this video, we'll be taking a look at three NHL games happening on January 18, 2023, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, four picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three NHL games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive betting picks to take your sports betting journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer anywhere from one betting pick a day up to 10 betting picks a day and much more. Now let's get started. Colorado Avalanche vs. Calgary Flames The Colorado Avalanche face the Calgary Flames with both teams looking to build off of promising seasons. The Avalanche have a 22-17-3 record and have won back-to-back -back games while the Flames have a 21-15-9 record and are in the middle of the Pacific Division. Both teams are looking to improve in the Western Conference and the upcoming game should be a great one as a result. The Avalanche are 89-37 in their last 126 games following a win and 126-61 in their last 187 overall. The Flames are 11-2 in their last 13 Wednesday games and 2-5 in their last 7 versus Central. The under is 19-9-2 in Avalanche last 30 overall. The under is 8-3 in Flames last 11 overall. The Avalanche are 4-1 in the last 5 meetings in Calgary and 8-3 in the last 11 meetings. The underdog is 8-3 in the last 11 meetings. The Calgary Flames should be favored at home, as these teams have been even this season for the most part. However, you usually don't have the Avalanche Avalanche at these sorts of prices and while they've been hit or missed these last few weeks they're still more than good enough defensively to get a big road victory. While the Flames have been the more consistent of these two teams this year, the Avalanche have the advantage over them as of late, with an 8-3 record against them in the past 11 overall, as well as an impressive 4-1 mark in the past 5 meetings in Calgary. Beyond that, the underdog is a dominant 8-3 in the last 11 head-to-head -head meetings between these two squads, so with Colorado coming in as the underdog, that's a great bet in this one, especially after two impressive performances seemingly have them building momentum. So the Colorado Avalanche money line is our full game side pick. While both of these teams have dynamic offensive players that can completely break games apart, their defenses are among the best in the NHL, and that shows in their meetings, with the under being 4-1-1 in their past six in Calgary. For the Avalanche, the under is 4-1-1 in their past six games on the road, while the under for the Flames is 8-3 in their past 11 games overall, so don't expect a repeat of their 5-3 meeting earlier in the season. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. Dallas Stars vs. San Jose Sharks the Dallas Stars will be on the road and they will take on the San Jose Sharks at SAP Center. Dallas has a record of 26-12-7. San Jose has a record of 13-23-9. These two teams faced each other twice this season, each winning one matchup. Dallas is 35-16 in their last 51 games against a team with a losing record and 1-5 in their last 6 Wednesday games while the under is 6-1 in their last 7 games overall. San Jose is 15-36 in their last 51 home games and 6 16 to 46 in their last 62 games overall while the over is 16 to 3 to 2 in their last 21 home games the nightcap of the nationally televised games brings us the Dallas Stars versus the San Jose Sharks from Northern California. The Stars have been treading water of late, going 6-3-1 in their last 10 games, and will need every point they can get as they are in a battle for first in the Central Division with the Jets. The Sharks, on the other hand, have struggled recently with only two wins in their last 10 games and find themselves near the bottom of the Pacific Division. The big advantage in this game is the Stars' defense. Since the beginning of the month, they have been one of the best units in the league by doing an amazing job at keeping pressure and the scoring chances to a minimum, ranking sixth in expected goals against. This tough defense has translated into keeping the puck out of their net, as they rank second in goals allowed per game with a mark of 2.14 in the same time frame. Trying to score on the Stars will be a Sharks attack that has been average at best. They currently rank 23rd in scoring, averaging 3.02 goals per game, and only have been slightly better of late. They 17th in goals per game since the start of January. Look for a tough Stars defense to keep the Sharks' offense limited. So the Dallas Stars' money line is our full game side pick. Both teams have been playing well on offense lately. The Stars scored three or more goals in six of the last 10 games. They rank seventh in goals per game. Jason Robertson leads Dallas with 60 points and he has recorded one or more points in seven 
10 out of the last 10 games. Robertson is fourth in points and tied for fifth in goals in the league. The Sharks scored three or more goals in six of their last nine games. However, goaltending has been terrible for San Jose this season. They rank 29th in goals against per game. This will be a higher scoring game. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. Tampa Bay Lightning vs. Vancouver Canucks The Tampa Bay Lightning will go on the road and take on the Vancouver Canucks at Rogers Arena. Tampa Bay has a record of 28-13-1. Vancouver has a record of 18-22-3. Both these teams faced each other once this season with Tampa Bay winning the matchup. The Lightning are 6-1 in their last 7 games following a win and 21-7 in their last 28 overall. The Canucks are 9-4 in their last 13 Wednesday games and 1-4 in their last 5 overall. The under is 2 to 0 to 3 in Lightning last 5 road games. The over is 33 to 16 to 6 in Canucks last 55 overall. The Lightning are 7 to 1 in the last 8 meetings in Vancouver and 5 to 0 in the last 5 meetings. The favorite is 5 to 0 in the last 5 meetings. Tampa Bay has fared well against the Canucks in recent matchups. The Lightning are 7 to 3 to 0 in their last 10 games against Vancouver. In the last 10 meetings, Tampa Bay averages 3.8 goals per game and Vancouver averages 2.8 goals per per game. Defense and goaltending are two advantages for the Lightning in this matchup. Vancouver ranks 30th in goals against per game and 24th in shots against per game, while Tampa Bay ranks 13th in goals against per game and 11th in shots against per game. Playing at home has not gone in Vancouver's favor this season. They have an 8-10-1 to to home record this season. Vancouver is struggling, losing 7 of their last 9 games, while the Lightning won 8 of their last 10 games. Tampa Bay is playing much better and they have had the Canucks number. The Tampa Bay Lightning are back in one of those grooves where the wins don't stop coming, and they're running into a Canucks team they've beaten up over the years. The Vancouver Canucks' lack of defense makes them hard to trust against quality sides, and they're not finishing games lately, so the Tampa Bay Lightning to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. Both teams have been good on offense this season. Vancouver ranks 8th in goals per game. They scored 4 or more goals in 6 of the last 10 games. Elias Pettersson leads the team with 52 points on the season. Bo Horvat has 48 points on the season. Horvat is tied for 4th in the league with 30 goals. Tampa Bay ranks 5th in goals per game. They scored 4 or more goals in 7 of their last 10 games. Nikita Kucherov leads the Lightning with 62 points. He has recorded 1 or more points in 8 out of the last 10 games. Kucherov ranks tied for third in points and second in assists among all players in the league. The over is 8-2 in the last 10 meetings between these two teams. Both teams have been very good on offense this season. This will be a higher scoring game. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyze. Subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.